Hey now, so it's Thursday, August 9th. I did graphing today. Uh, I like to graph minor league. I've talked about this before. The good thing about doing graphing the minor league is usually they all sign. Uh, I'm very lucky. I have sort of a connection at the uh, Lugnuts who's very good to me. I'm very fortunate. So we were able to get into the Lugnuts game early today. And the Lugnuts brought in someone who I'll get to in a moment who my son considers a goat. Like he belongs on the goat wall. I don't know if he belongs on the goat wall. My son believes he belongs on the goat wall. I'm wondering what you all in the YouTube community think. So I got the autograph, first of all, he was special appearance of Joey Chestnut right here. Uh, couldn't have been any nicer. He has gotta be, if competitive eating is a sport, and I'm not saying it isn't, it's very, let's say it is, this guy is one of the good guys in all of sports in terms of signing. Signing for everyone, the line was insane to get. Unfortunately, my son and I got in early, so he signed this photo, he described it Jaws. Uh, he took a photo with my son. We got there so early, and I'll show this in a minute. I was able to print it, come back, and he signed the pro photo I printed. It said, Ryan, stay hungry, Joey Chestnut. Could not have been any nicer. So Ryan, Ryan my son says, that should go on the goat wall. I, I don't know. I'm looking at the goat wall. I had Ruth, Ali, Brady, Jordan, and Joey Chestnut? Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe not. I got, I got Hulk Hogan on the wall, so... Uh, so yeah, is it? I don't know. You tell me. Let, let me know in the comments. So, otherwise, uh, Fort Wayne was playing Lansing, and so Fort Wayne has two top 100 prospects in baseball. One of them, I got right here. His name is uh, Robbie Snelling. Uh, he has one card out, a official card. It's a Bowman draft card. I couldn't find it in time, so I did was able to print a photo out, courtesy of my printer, uh, my framer, John. Thank you very much. So it's a beautiful photo. Uh, he couldn't have been any nicer. He took a picture with my son. Like I said, I ran, I got the photo signed. I'm gonna give this to my son in a second. I just wanna take a picture with it. So yeah, I got a photo as well. I almost got him on a baseball. Uh, I pushed back at the last second, I don't know. But someone on the Fort Wayne Tin Caps I did get on a baseball is this guy. His name is Ethan Salas. Uh, not a great signature as you can see right here. Google this guy. The kid is 17. He just turned 17. He is, I think, the youngest player in organized baseball right now. The Padres spent all their international draft money on this guy. He is supposed to be like the next superstar. Whether or not he turns into anything, I don't know. I think the last person, though, they prepped this high was Guerrero Jr. And look what happened to him. So I got that photo. I ran, printed it out. And uh, you can see right here, he put two Ryan, Ethan Salas. This guy was grumpy. I mean, he's 17 years old. My son and his friend were the only two in the stadium, literally the only two in the stadium, trying to get autographs. And like he signed, but very hesitantly. So I'm worried. I don't know what happened at Lake Elsinore, where he came from. I don't know what happened on Tuesday. He got called up to the Midwest, Midwest League on Tuesday. His first game was yesterday, Wednesday, so today. So I don't know if he's been hit hard and he just doesn't want to sign anymore or reluctant on signing. So he did sign. Uh, he limited like one per. He signed the second one because he came back later. He saw the photo. So yeah, he signed, not that great. Uh, I did get a couple other things signed as well. I'm looking for them right now. And of course I can't find them. That's like Murphy's Law. So anyways, the other one I did get signed. Nope, I can't find it. Is uh, this guy, his name is Jake Wilson. He was the number six overall draft pick for the Lugnuts. Uh, I got him on a baseball as well as Salas. I mean, will they pan out? I don't know. So hold on. I'm just going to look for what else I got signed. See if I can find it. I'm over here. I'm talking. I'm talking. I don't see what else. So I did get another card signed by another Lug Nuts player, but I don't know where it is offhand. So uh, I'm not going to show it. It's a 2003 guy. He's picked in the fourth round, like 95th overall. I forgot his name already. So it could have been that good. Oh, wait, hold on. <gasps> Look what I found. The cards. They're in my pocket. So, uh, anyways, Jacob Wilson had a couple of USA cards. So, he he could have been, again, could have been any nicer about signing. Signed this one as well, same card. Uh, Daniel Susick, he's a uh, catcher in the organization. I get on Lansing. Signed this card as well. And last but not least, here's the guy, Colby Thompson. So uh, I had no cards for Fort Wayne to caps other than that. So I don't know if you like, so that's about it. That's a recap of what I got signed today. 
I usually don't even do these minor league recaps except for like Joey Chestnut was there. So even though he's not baseball, so does he belong on the wall or not? I don't know. Do you like me doing minor league recaps? I'm probably going to go again next week to the baseball game to do the little uh, leg nuts because again, uh, I have a little bit of early access, so it's easier for me to get the players. But again, will these guys be these Hall of Famers? I don't know. So, anyways, thank you for watching, and as always, keep collecting.